This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe, and let's get right into the news. All right, so Young Guru says cap on Dame Dash saying that he tried to take Cameron's record. Oh, boy, because he did. He tried to jump on the remix. Uh, he Hustler, he tried to... Uh, he, he took that from Moschino Sparks. And then uh, Jaws record, can I get a... Um, he said he he's he took that from Ja Rule. It used to be Ja Rule's record, right? Now, why would Dame lie about that? He wouldn't. He wouldn't. Okay. Dame uh Jay Z did have a, a record of doing that to people, jumping on their record and making it his so he could perform it. Uh, then he gets credit for it. Um There's nothing wrong with that. It was a tactic he used, right? Dame Dash thinks it's messed up now, but I bet you at the time he was cool with it because it was it was their label, right? He just said, "Hey, Cameron's not going for that, and he's not going for it." Cameron deleted Jay Z's verse. He said, "Nah, nah, 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 he ain't doing that." Because I think he gave. Oh, damn, what what happened with that? Oh yeah, Jay Z didn't want to mess with it, so Cameron messed with it, made it hot, and then Jay Z wanted to jump on it. All of a sudden, when he tried to get him on it the first time, and he said, then later he wanted to get on it, he's like, nah. He's like, like, you're not going to just come in and jump on my record. Because, uh, oh, yeah, 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 they just recorded it. And he said, yo, I left something for you in the studio. <laughs> Cameron went in to listen to it, and he said, delete the, the verse. And the Guru was like, huh? He's like, delete it. So uh, Young Guru says, cap on this narrative that Jay Steele songs. Jay got I Just Want to Love You directly from Pharrell and made the song from scratch. Sparks says Rick James and the hook. <clears throat> then you got uh, Can I Get a was Irv's idea. Literally said Jay, get on this record. But please keep Ja. Love you OG, but nah. Of course Guru is going to defend Jay-Z. He needs to stick around, right? Guru's a G Guru's great. Okay, so I'm not I'm not dissing Guru at all. Like he's one of the best ever do it. But I'm just saying. The whole Bama's riding with Brazy. They're saying that uh this guy, uh finesse two times can't even go back to his hometown. You know, he was trying to diss Honeycomb Brazy saying, Oh, your mom's walking to the store, you broke. Da -da 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 -da. But it seems like Honeycomb Brazy got a lot more love in Alabama than Finesse Two Times. Finesse Two Times, honestly, is on his way out. He had a nice rise, didn't keep it going, got 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 feeling himself too much. And that's what happens, man. I'm be honest with you. Kanye West delays vultures till early January now. I'm not shocked. He needs to get the buzz up more. He'll do something crazy in the beginning of the year. But you know, you gotta let Kanye be Kanye, okay? I, I respect it. I, I wasn't expecting this album anyways. This <laughs> before the, It sounds good, though. It sounds good. Little Meech says, free Big Meech. Guru denies the claims. Oh, yeah, Cameron's. Uh, so first of all, Cameron, this picture right here, the Cameron got taken to court over it by the guy who took the picture, and the guy won. So Cameron's not supposed to sell merch, I guess, with it on it or something, and I guess he didn't license it properly, and Cameron had to pay him like forty grand or something like that, or fifty thousand. But what we're talking about is Cameron had an infamous pink Range Rover. Used to see it around Harlem all the time. He'd have different people drive it. It was like a mystery vehicle, you know. He he was all pink, pink in the inside, everything, right? Well, it's been sold a few times now, and. Now it's up for 16 grand. If you want to buy a problem, get this. But it is legendary. If I was Cameron, I'd buy it and just park it up. 16 grand? I know he doesn't care, but that was a infamous vehicle. That's it. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. There's not a lot going on. That's why there hasn't been a lot of news, but I appreciate you guys so much.